Hi everyone, it's Miss Amy from Camden Public Library and I was thinking about foxes. I came across one of my old um, crafts, uh, which we're going to do a fox craft uh, later on today, but I wanted to share some fox stories. So there are so many fox stories. So I'm going to, I pulled a bunch um, of fox stories that we have at the library, some great read alouds, picture books, nonfiction, some beginning readers. Um, this one I'm going to start with. This is Wild Fox by um, uh, Joellen uh, McAllister Seaman, and this was a Newbery award-winning book. Uh, it is a true story of a wild fox. Beautiful illustrations, just gorgeous. It is a mean classic uh, here in the library and received uh, this award. Um, so really, really cool. Um, these are some beginning readers that we have. This is A Pig, A Fox, and a Box by Jonathan uh, Fenske. Uh, classic tale, Aesop uh, Fable, The Fox and the Crow. This one is A Beginning Reader by uh, Diane Marwood and Barbara Nassasimbeni. This one is an I Can Read book, Fox is Late by Corey Tabor. Um, I also wanted to share a couple of chapter books that would make great read alouds with a fox character. So good for early elementary, um, not, uh, not super thick. Uh, this is by a friend of mine, uh, Tamara White, and this is a Cooper and Pack Rat story love these wild adventures. Uh, this is Mystery of the Missing Fox. So this is uh, set in Maine. Uh, it's a Junior Library Guild um, selection. Uh, there are four books in it and I know that she is reading, uh, writing an another story. So she has one about a loon, a bear, uh, an eagle, and a fox. So and a new one coming. So very exciting. Love them. So kids who love the outdoors, super, super fun. Classic, classic books. These are way back from like 1950s, maybe even earlier than that. Um, I don't know how long ago. Um, Thornton Burgess, uh, so let's see when these were originally written, oh my goodness, uh, 1874 to 1965, um, but, uh, yeah, the, so, uh, these are, um, The Adventures of Reddy Fox, uh, and this one is Old Granny Fox, so Trickster Tales, um, Fun Read Alouds, there's a whole series of these uh, children's thrift classics, so um, all animal, any animal stories. Um, this is Hector Fox and the Giant Quest by Astrid uh, Shekels. This one is Fox by Kate Banks and pictures by George Hallens Len. Uh, and this, uh, so Kate was born in Camden, Maine uh, a long time ago. She lives in um, overseas now, but um, yeah. So this is one of her stories. Love that. Uh, a newer one, The Fox on the Swing, Avelina de, de Quixote and Asra Kedulete. Uh, Along Came a Fox by Georgina Duch. Fox and the Box. Uh, story and pictures by Ivan Ivanson. Uh, what does the fox say? Uh, yeah, uh, based on a crazy YouTube uh, sensation that happened a while ago, uh, and illustrated by Sven Nyhus. Uh, this is super ridiculous. Um, yeah. Jack says quack and fish go blub and the seal goes, oh, 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 but there's one sound that no one knows. What does Fox say? 
uh, Red Fox Running by Eve Bunting. Beautiful story illustrated by my friend Wendell Miner. Gorgeous illustrations of the outdoors and a little uh, fox and its life. Uh, this one, a fox found a box. Oh, a lot of boxes in box stories. Um, fox and Socks, Dr. Seuss. Uh, fox Forgets uh, by Suzanne Bloom. Uh, Good Morning Little Fox by uh, an author that I met because she was friends with another library patron. So Cool by Marilyn Donovitz. Um, this one, The Fox and the Stork, a fable by Aesop. And this is illustrated by Carl Ruman, uh, retold by Carl Ruman, and illustrated by Alessandra Roberti. Uh, fox tales. So these are four Aesop fables, uh, illustrated and retold by uh, my friend Amy Lowry, who is uh, a main author illust uh, illustrator. Uh, this one by Nyla Magruder, How to Find a Fox, a Silly Story. Mother Fox and Her Cubs, uh, Amadine Momensu, super cute. Love the um, paper pieced collaging, like it a lot. So neat art. Um, and then Little Fox in the Snow. And there, of course, are lots more. Look at these beautiful little illustrations. So cute. Um, there are lots more stories about foxes with fox characters. Um, yeah. Uh, so check out some fox stories and uh, stay tuned later on for a great uh, fox um, craft. So hugs. Now you have a whole bunch of new books to think about reading. Put them on your reading list. Miss Amy, happy reading.